Hi everybody, it's Steph here and what we've got for you today is an absolutely stunning example of a Parker 51 Demi Vacumatic Fountain Pen. This particular one, I'm hoping you can actually see, is in this lovely cedar blue colour and it's got this gold filled cap which we'll show you in a little moment. First of all, the pen was really, well, it was launched 1947 and also in the year 1948, so it, it had a run of about two years. This particular one, as we'll show you in a moment, is, well, it's dated 1948. The Demi um, fountain pens, I believe, were actually launched as a ladies version although they're very correct, uh, collectible in their own in their own rights. Now, size-wise, if we bring on a standard Parker, you can see the Demi at the top here is a lot shorter than the standard 51 at the, at the bottom. Incidentally, the bottom one there is also a lovely cedar blue, but as a size comparison, there you can see the Demi is quite a bit shorter than the standard 51. So let's pop that to one side. As I say, this particular one is a vacuumatic, which we'll show you in a moment. Um, as we mentioned, it comes in this cedar blue. These particular pens were actually launched only with two, two caps. Um, one being a luster alloy cap, and this one being the correct cap is this, um, well, it's actually a gold filled, a gold filled cap. The pattern on it, let's keep it nice and still, is these lines that are running the length, running the length of the cap in equal, well, in equal spacing, and they they don't converge to the top like some of the um, some of the caps. But as you can see, there are these particular lines that run the whole length of the cap. You can see it's got the feather clip there, the nice recognisable Parker feather clip. And to the top, this one's got an absolutely stunning, glossy and very clear grey, grey jewel. Another way of telling whether this is the correct cap, if we keep it nice and still for you, you can see it's got the, the Parker is actually written over, over these uh, engraved lines. Now if we took it, turn it round for you to the back there, you can see it's got the imprint, the imprint reads um, 1 in 10, 14 karat gold filled and then just underneath there it's got the words made in Canada. So we've got a ca Canadian made Parker 51 Demi. Um, as I say, in absolutely stunning condition, it came to me in a quite a sorry state, we've fully serviced it, restored it, new diaphragm, we've stripped it etc. And now it's an absolutely beautiful example, in so much so that the the lines on these particular on this particular cap, you can actually feel to the touch. Sometimes they're actually worn and they they're quite smooth to touch. This this particular example, you can actually feel uh, you can feel the lines in this particular cap. So let's take the cap off like so. Let's give it a little bit of a twirl, give you different angles. Okay. Now, the top of the Demi pen is very, well, it's the same as a standard model. It's got this, um, this hooded section to the top, and you've got the clutch ring just to the bottom there. And you can see the, the nib to the very top of the, to the top of the section there. Let's give you a sideways view. Okay, there you go. And then if we turn it over, again, same as a standard, you can see it's got this, um, again, the hooded nib to the top. And you've got the feed underneath there, you can see it's been cleaned, it's in beautiful condition. Incidentally, the nib on this particular pen, although you can't see it, um, the imprint on the nib actually reads Parker 51. Underneath the park, sorry, it reads Parker, should I say. Underneath that, it it's actually says uh, Made in Canada. And then to the bottom of the nib, to the left, it's got 14 carat. And to the, to the right, to the bottom of this particular nib, it's correctly dated 1948. Now, although the nib is dated 1948, if we show you the imprint um, to the top of the barrel there. Again, we need to keep it nice and still for you. 
and I'm hoping you can actually see there the imprint clearly reads Parker 51 underneath that it's actually got made in Canada again and then underneath the made in Canada we've got the um, the date number which is on this particular one as we said before is the number 8 with the three dots which indicates it's the first quarter of 1948 so you can see the whole pen is actually correctly dated all in all a beautiful beautiful example now as we said it's a vacuumatic pen which means what we do we simply unscrew the blind cap like so and you can see it's got this plastic uh, pump filler to the end of the barrel there and at this point what I'll actually do if I bring on the other standard Parker and let's actually take the cap off like so and again just show you comparison again again underneath here we've got the Demi to the top there you've got the standard and you can see the barrel itself is quite a bit shorter than the standard 51 so let's pop that back to one side as I say we've put a new sack in it or a new diaphragm so we've not tested it so as always this is a good time as any to test the pen all we need to do dip the, the nib into the ink press down a couple of times on this plunger here so let's do it that'll do just for now just for a writing sample let's give it a wipe there was a lot of bubbling sound there so that indicates that everything sounds fine let's put the the blind cap back on and let's bring on a piece of paper so keep our fingers crossed at this point and what we have as I said is a Parker there we go we've got a 51 um, as we said this particular model is a superb example of the Demi vacu vacuumatic the date on this particular pen 1948 and that's the the first quarter and it's writing well with a fine line and to be quite honest with you it's a very very nice writer it's writing quite smooth very nice there's no flexibility obviously with this particular nib but as far as the writing very very nice nice writer so there we have a writing sample writing with a fine line nice and smoothly as well so let's pop the cap back on like so and there we have it ladies and gentlemen an absolutely beautiful example of a Parker 51 Vacuumatic made in Canada 1948 in absolutely superb condition fully serviced and fully working this would actually grace anybody's pen collection it's a beautiful example so I hope you've enjoyed looking at the pen as much as I enjoy showing them to you don't forget loads more videos on my channel go and have a look don't be shy but for now I'll just simply say bye bye now